It's happening. APC primaries, Tinubu, Osibanjo, Amechi, others scrap for 7,800 delegates. The battle is on and is a fierce one at that. You know, Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu, Professor Yemi Osibanjo, and others have to lobby. You know, the, the, the race is not yet getting, they've not gotten to where Nigerians are at the moment. This is within the party. First of all, before anything proceeds, before there is any moving forward, they need to first of all have what we call party primaries. Okay, primaries need to be done in the party. It's after that primary that we can begin to, you know, we must begin to, it's after the primaries that you can begin to analyze and say, yes, um, this person won the primary ticket and then they can move on to say, okay, the party primary ticket has been won. What's the next line of action? You see, the party primary ticket is the first, you first, the first thing when you are going for election, you pick up your interest nomination form. Then the people of the party has to believe in you. And that's why you see Osibanjo having meetings with press with the with the governors, the House of Rep, and um, the senators under their party, because if you look at it very well, these are the people who will vote. Okay, these are the people who will vote. You know, to pick who gets the primary tickets, who becomes the flag bearer. So Sibanjo, Tinubu, and the rest are beginning to you know go around these people. Let's get all the details. What is really going on? APC primaries. The race is on. The battle is tough. Tinubu, Osibanjo, Amechi, scrap for 7,800 delegates, APC members who will determine who becomes the party flag bearer. The vice president, Professor Yemi Osibanjo, the party national leader, Shiwajo Ahmed Bola Tinubu, Minister of Transportation, Rotimi Amechi, and others are in the battle for 7,800 delegate members of APC. Aside from the trail, five others aspirants, Governor David Omayi of Eboin State, Yahaya Belu of Kogi State, Business Tycoon Benga, uh, former Governor of Imo State, Roja Shokorocha, a, 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 Ike Chuku Dollars Chima have indicated interest in the very race to become president. Ekiti State Governor Kayode Fayemi is set to declare after the Ramadan and has started consultations already. Ahead of his declaration, also, a former governor of Ogun State, Ibikunle Omosun, is planning to declare for the race as well. The party has reportedly fixed May the 30th and 31st for the conduct of the presidential primaries in the party. However, these people have started going around members, all delegates as much as they can to get and to, to get their support and to stand for, to get their support and to ensure that they get them to stay with them. This is exactly what is going on now. Nigerians are watching as the day draws closer. Everyone is in anticipation what could potentially happen going forward. APC primaries will determine who becomes the flag bearer of the party. These are very delicate times. As we see again, these things are beginning to happen. And right now, everyone is skeptical. What next to expect? Everyone is going around lobbying the House of Representative members, the senators, as well as the governors and the party, asking for support during the primaries. Tinubu has had various meetings with governors elected under the platform of APC. The vice president, Professor Yemi Osibanjo, has also had meetings with some of these people even before declaring his intention to run for the position. Also, now the person of Amechi is going around and making huge promises with regards to what could potentially happen if he gets the ticket and how he will favor the people who have supported him. The race to become the flag bearer of the party is tough and is strong as everyone is working to ensure they be the ones to get the ticket. So this is exactly what is going on right now. There is second, there is serious, uh, you know, uh, lobbying. 
the matters are ongoing and everybody is particularly you know running the race and you know ensuring that they be the one to get the very you know the very party ticket and everybody is being you know that everybody is being uh, intentional you know but guess what this is where the promises come again the promises are all over the place you know they are making promises and they are you know everybody's saying yes i'm the one you are the one this that 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 a lot of promises are being thrown around at this point in time a lot of promises are being you know paddled all around but the truth of the matter is i tell you sincerely if nothing is done to solve the situation these people will go out lobby again get them to become the party flag bearer because whether you like it or not it's from one of these people you currently see that will get someone to become you know the party uh, flag bearer and it's from one of those whether apc pdp any other party that will become the president of this country if all things being equal the election holds you know and this is what will happen so therefore we cannot fold our arms close our eyes and say you know say that you know these things this uh, these things are not happening you know politicians they can do and undo they can do and undo politicians they will go for go to any length at any point in time they will go to any length at any point in time they will do and undo politicians huh, you don't know they will promise you heaven and heaven and earth just because they want you to be on their side but we cannot we cannot sit down and say, you know, uh, they have, because they will be the ones to bring out the person who, be, who gets the, the, the flag, who becomes the flag bearer of the party. They will be the one by their, you know, them picking. And those delegates, by the time they, they have picked, you will see how, you know, after those delegates have picked, then you will see what will follow next. So we cannot, uh, we can't stay back. We can't stay back and say these things are not happening. Whether you like it or not, it is sincerely happening. Yes, they are now. It is happening. It is happening. And that's why we cannot fold our arms and pretend that, you know, what we're saying is not true. These are the true reflection, the true reality of what is going on now. Lobbying is going around, backstabbing. When I become the president, I will give you opportunity to bring, I will, I will bring somebody for me to appoint as minister here and there. A lot of matters are going on. Okay, so you can be sure that um, everybody wants to get that position to be able to, you know, put their own, you know, their own spin on things. And that's why Nigeria is not moving forward. That's why. Leave us a comment. God bless. Bye for now.